Welcome to Ready, Set, Learn. I am the kindergarten teacher, Mrs. Burroughs at St. Joseph School. I would like to start with a song. The Adventure of the Little Caterpillar Once upon a time, there was a teeny tiny egg on a leaf and the moon was shining and that little teeny tiny egg was just sitting there on the leaf. But then, when the sun came up, something happened to that little egg. It started to crack started to wiggle and soon out of the little egg came a little tiny caterpillar and that little tiny caterpillar ate its shell first and then it started to eat the leaf and it ate and it ate and it ate munched and it was crawling around and the more it ate the bigger it grew and soon the little caterpillar wasn't that little anymore it was that big but he was lonely and you can't eat all day you would like to play as well so he was looking around and what did he see? He saw a little, a little, yes, it was a little mouse scurrying around. And the little caterpillar said, hey, hello. And the little said, what, what do you want from me? Please, can you play with me? Play with you? Ha, what would I play with you? All you do is crawl around and eat and munch. No, thank you. I'm going to play with my friend. Bye. Oh, the caterpillar was really sad. And so what should he do? He started to eat again. But then his belly got so full and he was so bored and he thought, I just would like to have a friend. Just one friend. I would be happy with one friend. Rupert? 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 Oh, what is that? Rupert? 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 <gasps> oh, hi! Hi. Rupert? Hi. Can you be my friend and play with me? to look at you. What are you? Oh, oh, you're just a little caterpillar. Make sure I don't eat you. Oh, oh no, you can't eat me. Well, then go away. I'm going to go play with my friend. Bye. And repeat, he left the little caterpillar. Well, he just kept on eating. But you know, the more he ate, the bigger he grew. And soon he wasn't a middle-sized caterpillar anymore. Now he was a huge, big caterpillar. And what else happened? He got so tired. And he thought, oh, maybe instead of playing, I'm just going to curl up and start sleeping. I just, I'm so tired. I just want to sleep. And then he started to 
started to make a bed for himself and he was making that bed really nice and cozy. Look at this. Whoa. Whoa. And it took him quite a while. It took him probably a whole night till that bed was ready. You know what it's called? What the caterpillar made? He makes himself a chrysalis. It's like a little bed to sleep. It's not ready yet. It just takes time. And he wiggled and he wiggled and he got, oops, there, a little bit more. And then at the end, when all was done, He just was hanging there and sleeping. Sometimes he wiggled, but most of the time he just slept a long, long time. But while he was sleeping, something happened. Something happened in the chrysalis. And one day he felt, oh, it's so tight in here. I need to get out. And he started to, he started to open up and he started to come out, out of that chrysalis. Oh. He sat there for a while till his wings were dry. And soon he felt, oh, I think I can stop moving my wings. And he started to fly. Whoa, that is so cool. I can fly. Wow, I can fly. Look at that. I can fly. He sat on a leaf and said, I better go and find it and go find a flower because I think I like flowers. So he went and looked for a flower. When he came back, he noticed something. There was a little caterpillar on his leaf. And he said, Hi, I'm Charlie. And the caterpillar said, Hi. I'm Katie. You are so beautiful. And Charlie said, well, would you like to be my friend? Well, but I'm just a caterpillar and you are a butterfly. You know what? Said Charlie. I was a caterpillar too. We can be friends. Are you sure? Of course. And Charlie was flying around and soon he saw the mouse coming by and the mouse said, Oh, butterfly, butterfly, would you like to be my friend? Do you know what Charlie said? I have a friend. I only need one friend. Bye. Oh. And then the frog came by and said, Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Oh, what a nice butterfly. Can you be my friend? I already got a friend. Bye. And that's what it was. Soon, Katie grew and grew and then she turned into a chrysalis and then she was a butterfly. And Charlie and Katie were very happy together. Mm -mm.
Now we're gonna make our very own caterpillar. We're gonna use the paper that you find in the package and you have to look for a plate that is almost as big as that paper. Then we're gonna trace it. And we have a circle. We're gonna cut out the circle and make sure that your hand is always cutting away from you and you go little, little bites, little bites, little bites, little bites. After we cut out one, two, three, four, five circles, we can start to put our caterpillar together. First, we're gonna start with our head and I think my head needs some eyes. So I'm gonna take my googly eyes, take some glue and put it on. And of course, my caterpillar is a very happy caterpillar. So he has a, going to have a big smiley face. There we go. There is my caterpillar face. Now, Oh, antennas, right. So I'm gonna take my um, pipe cleaner, I'm gonna fold it in half, and I can actually cut it with the scissors in half. And I found a nail and a little bit of styrofoam because I wanna make some holes to put the, there one, two, to put the antennas in. Here and here. Good. That looks. I think that looks good. All right. And now we're gonna glue our caterpillar together. So we're gonna use the back. I'm gonna put some glue on here. And there's first part of the body, another bit of glue, second, oh it's gonna be a really big caterpillar, that's so much fun, there and the last one, so now it also has some legs. So we're gonna use our nail again. And go one, two, three. And the second um, pipe cleaner, and we're gonna fold it in three pieces and cut it. Now we're gonna put it in here. Four legs. 